This is part six of Make My Newspapers tutorial series on how to use our Cloud Newspaper Designer. Let's go ahead and launch the designer from our home page. In this tutorial, we'll be showing you how to use the automated alignment tools that are available and our grouping tools. Let's begin by dragging down a text box into our canvas area. We'll go ahead and drag down a shape as well. Let's use a rectangle box. The alignment tools are automatic. Notice that if I move my shape box, blue lines will appear that shows you that it is now aligned with the text box above it. In this case, it's aligning to the center of the text box because our shape box is exactly the same size. But if I shrink my shape box, now you see just a left blue line that shows my box is now aligned with the left side of the text box. If I move it over, I eventually find the center of the text box, which shows the shape box is now aligned to the center of the text box. Keep moving, and now it shows the left side of the shape box to the right side of the text box. No matter how you move any object in your design, the alignment tools will give you a suggestion of proper alignment. This is true of all lines, boxes, text boxes, and pictures. The grouping tools are also a great feature to utilize to make your design experience extremely easy. Let's say I want to grab and move both my text box and my shape box without losing the position they're in. No problem, just right click and choose the select all choice. Notice that all objects on the page are now selected and I can move them together as I wish. By the way, you can also grab them by holding down your cursor and dragging around the elements that you want to group. As well, you can choose an object, hold down your shift key, and grab another element as well. All of these options are available to you as you design. And don't forget, you can copy and paste in groups as well. If I have grabbed a group, just hit the copy button on the top right menu, and then paste, and there you go. You can also use your right-click tools as well to copy and paste. Even more importantly, don't forget that you can copy and paste to and from not only any page in your design, but you can also copy and paste from project to project. You have full control of copy and paste no matter where you need your objects. That's your alignment and grouping tools and concludes part six of our designer tutorial series. We hope you visit other videos as you need them and subscribe to our YouTube channel to be notified of any new videos that might be posted. Happy designing everyone!